don't like Drip's driving style. Always stop at squirrel crossings. On the table today, it is all about Fortnite with the remote control ATK all terrain cart with drift. Ooh, look, a try me button. That's right, lights and sounds on the ATK. And of course, rubberized wheels for traction. Don't worry, squirrel, we won't run you over too many times. On the back of this fancily angular box, we have a drawn in-game image of the ATK rolling about how's your driving, and Drift dressed down all the way to his default style, I believe. Drift, journey into the unknown and find your way to victory. Also available, a bus drone, which I have not seen, and a quad crusher, I have seen that. Okay then, well let's unbox the ATK, find some riders, and go for a ride. Did they seriously really need to screw in the ATK into the cardboard on the back of the box? It was like going back to shop class 101 on that one. But there it is, the mighty ATK, all set for travels. Not yet, it's gonna need batteries. Oh, that's right, we need batteries here. Three AA and two AAA. Drift, I'm not just paying you to hold that stop sign back there. Get on the batteries. Ugh, okay. While Drift is busy, let's spin the cart around a bit. Looks good from all around. Oh, wait, do we need to remove that yellow arrow sticker on the hood? Ah, I actually kind of like it now. Should have left it. But there, on the front of the hood, is our sound effect button. Give it a press. We have ATK vehicle noises, light up pipes on the sides, and a nice little emergency warning. The ATK looks loaded with room for travel. I love mini vehicles with plenty of spots for action figures. If needed, you can remove this roof so it may be a little easier to place figures inside. It's really quite versatile. Well, where is Drift with the batteries? We need to get the batteries going. There's the double A's. I'm looking for the triples. Hang on. Okay, Drift, while we wait, we will install the doubles. So if you're dumbfounded that I didn't think that there were batteries inside even when the vehicle was already making try me noises, raise your hand. Well I will say that the batteries were for try me only and it's possibly they are weaker than a normal brand and I want my ATK to really fly so I'm going to place my own batteries in. And while we are underneath the ATK, let's get it switched to officially on. It's making some new sounds already. Yeah, the batteries included were pretty light. I'm okay switching those out. Maybe I'll hold off on the triple A's that are inside the remote. I found the triple A's for the remote! Oh, uh, thanks Drift, but I think I decided to go with what is included with the box here. Huh? Yeah, usually remote batteries last longer than the batteries going to use the mechanical natures of the cart. We'll just hold on to them for later. Oh, squirrels. Well, I think we're already near time for drive. Oh, let's really quick place this golf bag in the back of the cart. Kind of a neat little spot to store extra weapons. Maybe a rolled up dollar bill or something, I don't know. Okay, Drift, hop into the driver's seat and let's see if we can start this thing up. I've been waiting all day for you to say that. Okay, Drift is ready to go. I've got his hands gripped onto the steering wheel pretty good. There's also a floorboard peg for his foot, but it seems like it keeps popping off, but it's there. I think he'll hold on okay on that steering wheel. Now we can place back down the cover of the ATK. And I think we're all set for our first voyage. Ah! Uh, voyage is for boats. Drive is for cars. Oh yeah, right. All right, well I'm pretty sure the ATK is switched to on, so now I suppose, does this need to be switched on anywhere? There we go on and now here we go what happens hmm nothing 
okay, there's just a little more to just having them both on to get them to go. You need to do this within 30 seconds to get them to link. So let's switch off. Now switch the cart back on. Switch the remote back on within 30 seconds. And it should pair to each other. Oh, the light's solid. That's got to be a good thing. Whoa! <laughs> Ouch! Drift! That kind of hurt. Whoa, this thing is really fast. It's like watching Austin Powers drive something. Oh, ow, drift, stop it. Oh, sorry, Landry. Oh, we are gonna need more space. Oh, oh and drift goes off the table. Not bad at all. We're just going to need a little more table room. Uh, how's Drift doing, Triage Trooper? He took a bad hit, but he'll be okay. Glad to have you here, Triage Trooper. Okay, Drift, hop back into the driver's seat if you can. Uh, uh, uh. You know, maybe if we work together this time, we won't have such a bad accident. Well, let's find a few more figures to load in. The back of the box has DJ Yonder on for a ride. I'm sure he'll provide some good tunes. I will. You can see the figure's feet will peg onto the back pegs. However, I would have liked to have seen a better grab bar. He is so gonna go flying off the side. Yeah, I hate to overextend their kung fu grip, but it looks like DJ Yonder can hold on to the bars of the ATK. Right up. The box also has Ruckus along for the ride, so let's also place him on the back. You might be able to use the little mini flagpole as a grip too. That leaves one more seat for shotgun. Let's try out Dark Bomber. All right, well, let's go for an official drive now. Hopefully we won't get hurt. I think the remote has already been unpaired, so we're gonna have to turn everything off again. And go for a spin. I'm back here for racing. Look, it's a giant fort squirrel. to you guys did you hit a fence or something Ugh. a golden retriever what is that all about where's ruckus boy did you guys go on an adventure well I would say overall the ATK performs rather squirrely if you're good at RC you can drive it around pretty well but it doesn't always follow a straight line very well. So there's a little bit of adjusting here and there. We do have a steering alignment lever underneath the ATK if you need to get a more solid steer. But for the most part, I found it pretty squirrely. 
Just find a nice, smooth pad to work with and drive around and have some fun. I also would add that I wish this roof would hold a little stronger. It pops off pretty quickly, but it's no deal killer. Overall, a pretty fun vehicle to play with. Well, Drift, where are you going next? I'm going mini putt-putt. Ah, miniature golf. Sounds fun. The Fortnite ATK All-Terrain Cart Remote Control with Drift Figure Included arrives on store shelves fall 2019, runs approximately $40. If you're looking for a vehicle that holds lots of Jazzwares 4-inch figures to drive about town and all around, the ATK is a fun vehicle to play. Just make sure if you're driving out in the wild, don't hit fences, pea shooters, and golden retrievers. That's what I have to say about that.